Hey, what's up guys? Mike here from Art of Alpha. I just finished editing and posting a blog, a new blog post on the website artofalpha.com and I had a guy, client, was asking me how to become alpha. So how can I become more of an alpha male? And a lot of times we think that being an alpha male means muscles, cars, more money. People think that it means all these things, but really, it's here. Becoming an alpha male is all about the mindset. It's do you have boundaries? Do you have beliefs in yourself? Do you have confidence in yourself? Do you feel that you're worthy? And I see a lot of the clients feel like, say they're, they wanna go talk to a girl or they wanna go start a business or something, they feel like they're not worthy. They feel like no one's gonna buy from them. They feel like they're gonna go talk to the girl and she's not gonna be interested. So really, it's not, they could go get bigger muscles, they could go get a nicer car, but it doesn't, that's not gonna fix their mind. That's not gonna fix their beliefs of themselves. If they have negative beliefs, then that's what we wanna focus on, we wanna fix that. So in this article I talked about uh, some of the things that you can do to become more of alpha, change your mindset. So some of the things that I did personally is you wanna do things that scare you. You wanna do things that every time you think something's impossible and you do it, every time you're scared but you take the chance and you do it, your confidence goes up every time because of that. So I was in Arizona and there was this cliff and one of my friends jumped off of it, this big cliff jumping spot. And I thought, I can't do that, I'm terrified. I don't wanna jump off that cliff. Time to face the fear. Climbing up for the jump. I know, scary. Oh, look at that. Jump, baby. But you uh, did it. Whew. But yeah, that's high. I want to jump off that cliff. And I climbed halfway up, and then I stood there, and I said, I can't do this. But eventually, I finally jumped, I did it, and it was amazing. It was one of the best experiences ever. And because I did that, now I have that little experience that no one can take away from me. If I go talk to a girl and she's not interested or something happens and someone's opinion of me isn't what I want it to be, then I always have that experience that I did. I overcame that fear and it always I'll always have that that no one can take away. So you want to have these experiences, develop these different things that you're doing. You're traveling, you're taking chances, you're, you're doing things that you're passionate about, you're... All, every time you do that, your confidence and your self-esteem goes up and anytime someone has a negative opinion, it's not going to affect you because you know, yeah, I did that. I jumped off that cliff. I started that business. I approached that girl I liked. So every time you do that, your self-esteem goes up and when you do that, you become more of alpha because alpha is about the mindset. It's about how you feel about yourself. So some of the other things I did was I competed in Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. I competed in, or I did a salsa dance, uh, turn, like a salsa dance performance. I started a business. I practiced talking in front of the camera. So you wanna do all these things that are going to help you become more alpha. So you wanna develop this alpha mindset where you have boundaries. You don't take crap from people. You know what you're, you can tolerate and you stand up for yourself. Another thing that you can do is a gratitude journal. So this is something that my dating coach uh, that I had before taught me, gratitude journal. Sometimes we think about all these things that we don't have and we forget the things that we do have. So you wanna write down in a journal, maybe every day, maybe other day, things that you're grateful for. So things that you're proud of that you've done, things that you're happy about. And also you wanna stop the negative talk. So say you go out and you approach a girl and it doesn't go well. Well, at least you can say, yeah, I didn't feel like going out, but I went out. I'm grateful that I went out. I'm grateful I had a friend to go out with. And I'm grateful I'm healthy enough to actually go out. So focus on the things that you're grateful for, things that you have, and don't focus on the things that you don't have that you want. So gratitude journal is very helpful. So definitely start doing that.
And one other thing too, mentor, a coach, a mentor. In the last year, I've done a boot camp with Evolution Daily. I've done two confidence workshops. Uh, I hired a online business coach. So I've done hired a lot of coaches, a lot of mentors, and I would definitely recommend that. And if you're looking for someone, if uh, for a coach, if you need any business advice, any dating or confidence, then definitely DM me Art of Alpha Coaching on Instagram, or check the links down below. I'll leave my email. DM me Art of Alpha Coaching, and I do in-person boot camps in Boston, New York, Miami. So. Check the link down below. You can send me a message. Make sure you subscribe to the channel because I'm going to be putting out new videos every single week. So subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video.